guys welcome to my channel so today I recreated this look this was inspired by makeup Irma I'm gonna have her Instagram down below so definitely go check her out I love all her makeup looks they are so pretty and colorful and I'm a really big fan of color so if you would like to see how I created this look just keep on watching okay first thing I'm doing is applying an estrogen all over my face and this one is from Equate Beauty And to moisturize, I'm using the Total Moisture from Benefit and I'm going to be applying that all over my face. And then for eye cream, I'm using the Shiseido Eye Cream. And you just want to make sure you make this face so it really gets in there. I'm also going to be using the Puff Off from Benefit and this is a great alternative if you can't afford eye fillers, it's just going to smooth out your under eyes and get rid of the puffiness. And then you also want to make that ugly gorilla face when you apply that. And to prime my face, I'm going to be using the Smashbox Primer Water. And then I'm going to be applying some chapstick. Do not forget this step. Nobody likes crusty lips. For brows, I'm using the Cabrow in number 5. To prime my eyelids, I'm going to be using the MAC Soft Ochre Paint Pot and the brush I'm using is from Crown. It's the C457 brush. For this look, I'm going to be using the Morphe 35OM palette. And I'm going to be using this matte white shade and putting that underneath the brow bone and I'm using a flat brush from BH Cosmetics and I'm also putting it all over the lid Using the Morphe E27 blending brush I'm going to be picking up this orange shade and using that as my transition shade Picking up this darker brown shade, I'm using the Morphe M518 brush. This is a smaller blending brush and I'm going to be putting that underneath the transition shade. And then I'm just going to be blending out everything together with the E27 blending brush. Using the same smaller blending brush, I'm picking up a darker brown shade and putting that in the outer corner. And you just want to start stabbing it in there, just so it looks dark and well blended. Now I'm using this concealer from MAC and I'm going to be cleaning up the lid, creating a half cut crease. And then I'm just going to blend out the edges and add a little bit more of that dark brown. Using the Luxie 211 brush, I'm going to be setting that concealer with the same color we put all over the lid. And then I'm blending out the edges again. For eyeliner, I'm using this tar clay pot called Goldilocks and I'm going to be creating a wing using this eyeliner brush from Real Techniques. I'm using are from Coco Lashes in the style Queen Bee. 
For primer, I'm using the Makeup Forever Step 1. I put way too much. For foundation, I'm using the Benefit Stick Foundation in the color Tea Party. The brush I'm using is from Morphe. I'm not sure of the name, but it came in a set and they all have this white handle on it. For concealer, I'm using the Naked Skin and this is in the color Light Warm. And then you're just gonna dab, 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 dab. <laughs> Have you guys seen that video of the dad does the voiceover? It's so funny. And then to bake, I'm going to be using the RCMA translucent powder and applying that with my beauty blender. To set my whole face, I'm going to be using the Benefit Hello Flawless and the color I use is Champagne and I'm using this BH Cosmetics brush. I know I look like a ghost right now, but I'm going to be applying the Hula Bronzer from Benefit and I'm going to bronze my face. The brush I'm using is from Mikasa Beauty. It's the F111 brush and I also have a coupon code in the description box if you'd like to use it. And for highlight, I'm using the Urban Decay highlighter called Sin, and the brush I'm using is also from Morphe, it's the M438 brush. And I sprayed my brush with the primer water from Smashbox. And right here, I'm just adding a little bit of bronzer on the sides of my nose, just to add some color. For blush, I'm using Coralista from Benefit, and the brush I'm using is the Morphe E4 blush brush. And I'm just going to clean up underneath the contour with the translucent powder. And now I'm just basically doing the same thing I did in the crease using the same colors, and the brush I'm using is the Mikasa E310 brush. And this brush is from Coastal Scents. For the waterline, I'm using the NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk. And this is a happy me when my boyfriend surprises me. And I'm just gonna apply mascara on the lower lashes. I'm using the Better Than Sex Mascara from Too Faced. For lips, I'm using Lime Crime and this is in the color Teddy Bear. And to set my face, I'm using the Primer Water from Smashbox. this is the final look I hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure to like and subscribe if you'd like to see more videos I'll see you in my next one bye